Meg Crazy as chairman Patrick Whitesell invited WME's clients to his wife's party, except for Megan. Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck enjoyed a night on the town on Saturday as they parted for Powell Pierre Miller's 40th birthday. The 54-year-old singer exuded glamour in a green satin dress, which she wore beneath a cosy white coat while arm-in-arm arm with a 51-year-old husband. Completing her ensemble, she carried a gold clutch bag and donned matching heels for the Los Angeles celebration in honour of the Australian model and actress. On the other hand, Ben looked sharp, adhering to the event's smart dress code by opting for a black suit and white shirt. Former Home and Away actress Pierre and her Endeavour talent agency chairman husband Patrick are longtime friends of J-Lo and Ben and were among the guests at their 2022 wedding. Aussie actress Pierre Whitesell, formerly Pierre Miller, secretly married a multi-millionaire Hollywood talent agent boyfriend Patrick Whitesell in May 2021. Whitesell may not be a household name, but is a mover and shaker in Hollywood. The talent agent is the executive chairman of Endeavour, who with longtime business partner Ari Emanuel reportedly owns Endeavour shares worth around $840 million. His net worth sits at around $440 million. Patrick's clients include Ben Affleck, Christian Bale, Matt Damon, Michelle Williams, Idris Elba, Jake Gyllenhaal, Hugh Jackman, John Krasinski, Jude Law, Ryan Reynolds, Denzel Washington and Meghan Markle. His clients were invited to Pierre Miller's birthday except for Meghan Markle. Companies are and should be afraid to associate with that one. WME's working hard for her. All the fluff pieces over the past year and nothing has helped. Most of the attempts at swaying the public have backfired horribly. That one signed with WME in April. They've been trying to get a contract for six months without success. Rumour has it that the agency will cancel a deal with her in the end of this year. It comes after Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are suffering their worst nightmare as their popularity takes a hit, an expert has claimed. This comes after the rest of the royal family experienced good news over the past few months, with King Charles promoting his right-hand man Lieutenant Colonel Johnny Thompson of the 5th Battalion Royal Regiment of Scotland. The announcement made on Twitter has made critics question the role of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, with the Earthshot Prize ceremony taking place early next month. All eyes will be on Harry's brother Prince William. Critics believe that this will generate plenty of press attention and social media coverage that will be viewed by Harry and Meghan from their California residence. With more and more positive coverage of the UK family, the Sussexes could lose their public image credibility. Daniela Elsa via News.com commented, Harry's about, to have to wear bitners. Harry's about to have to bear witness to a swath of press coverage about just how brilliant a philanthropist his older brother has become. Added to which is the fact that in watching the bells and whistles Earthshot bandwagon be rolled out again, the Duke will be reminded of what he and Meghan gave up when they hung up their royal spurs. The connections, the cash and the awesome convening power of royalty. The day before the Earthshot prize will see press flocking to Tampa, Florida, where Meghan's sister Samantha Markle is suing the Duchess for defamation. Samantha's seeking $75,000 worth of damages.